Hi, I'm six years old. I'm a source chef, and today I'm going to be talking about the solar system. Since you can see a lot, then that means I'm talking about the solar system. And I also have my friends, so come on, friends! Uh, so also my friends are going to be talking more than me because I know this is my channel, but because they know better than me, they've been learning all week. I mean, all year about this solar system, and let's go to it. Okay, hello everyone, my name is Kate. Today, I'll be telling the parts of the solar system. The parts of the solar system are the sun, the planets, the asteroid belt, the asteroids, the Kuiper belt, and the meteorites. Uh, okay, so I am going to tell you the whole solar system. So. The first, the first planet is Mercury. Mercury is the smallest and the closest planet to the sun. Okay, the second planet is Venus. Venus is the hottest planet because it has greenhouse gases covering it. The third planet is Earth. Earth is the only planet to support life because of the, the temperature and then the oxygen and liquid water. And then the fourth planet is Mars. Mars is called the red planet because it has a lot of rust. And then, and then um, the asteroid belt um, is like a, gr a lot of asteroids. And then, and then Jupiter is the biggest. Hello, uh, I'm going to present about the outer planets. Uh, the the first outer planet is Jupiter. Jupiter is the biggest planet. And then uh, Saturn. Saturn has beautiful rings made out of ice dust and gas. I mean, ice dust and rocks. And then uh, Uranus. Uranus is the first ice giant. And Neptune is the coldest planet. Thank you. Hey guys, the planets do move. They move in two ways, rotation and revolution. I will take my friend to, I will, I will make my friend show and demonstrate it. Sasha, take a chair and take it as the sun. Okay. That one. Okay, what do we do now? Then rotate. This is this is rotation. Faster. <laughs> Faster. <laughs> this is rotation. Next. Revolution. Jack. Kate. Stop, stop, stop. Okay. Now Jack and Kate will will be showing revolution. Jack will be the sun and Kate will be the planet. <laughs> no, just spin. Just, no, just go around him. This is what revolution means. So I'll show you this mechanic of Ow! this solar system. It's able to move and shine light. So I'm going to ask you guys some questions. Are you ready? Yes. Are you ready? Okay. How many planets are there in our solar system? Sorsha, get the microphone. Okay. There are, oops, sorry. Go. There are actually nine planets, but you will sometimes see in videos, they show you eight planets. You know why? There's one dwarf planet and it's called Pluto! Good job, Jack! And Pluto is one of the smallest and also coldest planets in the solar system. And that's why scientists think that they're too small to be one. So they turned it into a dwarf planet, and that's why there are only eight planets left. Thank you. Well done. No uh, next one. How long does the Earth take to complete one revolution? One revolution. Jack! It takes 
365 or 366 days. Okay. Next. How long does the earth take to complete one rotation? Uh, Namking. The earth takes about, about 30 to 31 days. To no, one rotation. Uh, 24 hours. 24 hours. Okay. <laughs> Next, Kate. Okay. So this is just me left because my friends said that they had to go home. But it's just me left at least. So please subscribe to the Solar System channel. I did Solar System so many times. I think you guys should get it. So comment down below what's one of the questions I said in the video. And one of them are, have you subscribed and like yet? <laughs> so see you in the next video for 24 minutes. Okay. This is the last day for IP1, but not for my mom. Sorry, mom. <laughs> and I'm going to IP2 next. So maybe I can have new ideas. What is IP2? You mean grade 2? I mean, I mean grade 2. Sorry, you guys. <laughs> and I can't wait to show you my new grade 2 adventure. So please comment down below if it's nice or not. I'm scared to you. John won't like me. But just... I need to go home. <laughs>